Hi, my name is Nicholas Hasem. I'm the Secretary General's Special Representative for South Sudan and the head of United Nations peacekeeping mission, UNMIS. Every year on April the 4th, we mark the International Day of Mine Awareness and Assistance in Mine Action across South Sudan. Landmines and unexploded ordnance continue to be a tangible reminder of the devastating cost of conflict. They pose a daily threat to women, children and men in this young nation, to our peacekeepers and to our humanitarian workers. This year's global theme is Mine Action Cannot Wait. This is especially significant for South Sudan, considering last month's tragic incident where 10 children and young adults were killed by a single unexploded ordinance. My deepest sympathies to their families and loved ones. For UNMAS, preventing such loss of life is crucial. We therefore partner with UNMAS, the UN agency leading a proactive and coordinated response to the serious issue. UNMAS has been working in South Sudan since 2004 and its brave deminers have cleared millions of square meters of land contaminated by explosive hazards. They build capacities and partnerships with the National Mine Action Authority, training committed South Sudanese miners to keep people safe and restore their access to vital services and resources. Most importantly, UNMAS teaches communities themselves to recognize and report such hazards in their midst. Effective and prompt clearance of unexploded ordnance lies at the heart of what we at UNMIS are mandated to do. Protect civilians, guarantee their access to necessary humanitarian aid, support voluntary returns and build a durable peace. It's about ensuring children have the freedom to go to school, communities to farm their lands without fear and people can shape prosperous futures for themselves. In short, it is the key to sustain peace and development. On this year's International Mine Action Day, I send my gratitude to all brave deminers across South Sudan for their steadfast commitment to keeping others safe and secure. Importantly, I urge all community members, if you see something suspicious or potentially dangerous, please report it immediately. Your action could save lives and livelihoods.